Welcome aboard. I'm Captain Jake, and we're back with another episode of Order of Battle of World War II. This game was developed by the Aristocrats and published by Slytherin. So, welcome back to my channel. Appreciate you being here with me today at this episode. So let's go ahead and get loaded up here. We are playing the Red Star campaign, and we are on turn 18 of the Rostov scenario. Going up to turn 24, so let's go ahead and get loaded up here. Take a look at what our plans are for today. If I remember correctly, what we're going to be doing primarily is going after secondaries. And they are not threatening any of our primaries, and we want to see if we can capture the secondaries. Which will assist us in... Our follow-on which will be Moscow so take hold or retake we are definitely holding and we don't have to worry about retaking it and those are the two uh, victory locations we have to never lose uh, this one which right now they have nothing pushing us because we're able to beat them back. And this next one over here. And so that's uh, what? Volostograd uh, and uh, Stalino. And then we have to evacuate three cargo trucks in five turns, which we accomplished. And then take four secondary objectives, which we have apparently have captured one. Here's one that we have to capture. Here's the second one we have to capture. Here's the third one we have to capture. So that's four. And then if we can capture this one, even better yet, that would be uh, the fifth one. We've got to be careful of this particular uh, gun. So let's see what's our first First thing we're going to do today, we moved our artillery down here, so that's what we're going to use. Now oh, let's close that up. So we're going to continue battering this, attempting to take this. I'm hoping that this is the only German unit, since we can't see another unit there, which it's a major town, so very easily. Here... We got an engineer units and uh, a flak units. We should be able to take care of them. We're going to, I guess, first off, let's bombard the head of our room. over to here so let's go ahead and he missed he's still pretty strong though what we're looking for this guy down here and we're leaving the that guy out. It's over infantry, which we don't have to rush to capture that one. We lose on that count. All right, this guy uh, needs to be pulled back. Take him here. See if I can get that guy out in the open. Here. 
him here. Move him to here. Move him to here. And we should take him. That's what we want to do. Move him into there. Now we'll get this. 34 mod. Not sure whether I should move him up or not. So let's go ahead. Move him to here. I move him to and get him close enough. So, well, we move him to here. We should be able to block. Hmm. All right. Move this guy. Enough units down there now, so Take 31, but damn right, let's do it. Let's see who have I not moved. Worried about him anymore. Not really worried about him. Click through aviation unit. No, thank you. Hmm. Uh, scripts to stay in there. Move him to here. No reason to move him up and get him hurt. Right. This guy, don't know. We shall see what happens. We did say try to do it as quickly as possible because that would help us. So we will wait and see here. Let's just continue. Looking at our units here. I got one point, can't do anything with like that. So. That is a heavy weapons unit, so let's, first off, let's move this out of here, move him to there, okay, leave him to block, that's infantry, they may attack, they may not, we don't know, okay, that will be it, and this aviation unit, uh, we'll leave grounded for now. So we'll call that the end of our turn. See what they do on theirs. Yeah, 
figured he was going to attack. I can't blame him for that. Hmm. That was it, huh? Okay. Better yet. Fly him back. Let's see where we have a good airfield. We can take it to go. Uh, take it right up that direction. So now, Super, we're not going to send a tank in there. We'll send this infantry unit in there. So we will wait and see what we get here. Okay. And then this guy. Okay, we've done as much as we can do to that guy. Leaving him. Move him up and use the artillery on him. Even a four artillery is better than none. And not really going to move anybody else. We'll just call that our turn. Because his turn goes by pretty quick. Yeah. I thought we have two of four. Okay, so now what we do is back him. So now Don't know what's in there, so let's see if we can see it. Now we can bombard it. And All right, now. About him for now. Let's go ahead. Now, let's take that guy out. Do 
it out in the open now, should die. Come on, boobers, let's go, boys. There you go. That'll work. So, let's see here. I got VT7. I need to heal up. Got this guy to go. All right. I think we will. That guy may try to hurt me, but I don't think he will. There's a truck back here, and I could push him this way. But I don't know. He doesn't want me to. It didn't give me that as a as an option. So. Let's go ahead. Uh oh. Cancel. Where is it? There he is. That's why I have that warning on, because I lose sight of the airplane. Okay. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh, crap. Hold on. Now we can hit continue. Okay. Oh, look. Uh, can go naval, but we ain't going to. Okay. This guy's going to be a tough nut to crack, isn't he? supplied from but that's okay I thought <laughs> oops we're gonna keep uh, fighting each other until Such time, okay. Oh, my T-34s. As well as possible for the next time, okay. I think I can get there in time, but we'll keep moving. Okay, cancel. I wonder who that is. Up to here. Ah, I should have been far enough down. Should have been flying him down. Right. Now, down one, two, one. Guy. 
next. Uh. I should be flying. Alright, I'm gonna drop a load of bombs on him next time. Alright. Right. Well, didn't get it with any extra turns, that's for sure, but... Go through and see who I can use the 13 on. Out oh, getting rid of a ah. Okay, that is a 40. There we go. All right, last one and turn. Major victory. Svatka is delighted about your victory, but there is no time to celebrate. Your forces are to be sent back to Moscow immediately to defend the Wehrmacht's last ditch effort to take our capital. All right, close. All right, interesting. Exit, and that would be a no. Well, I've gained four specialization points. You want to consult? Yes, we do. You now have a total of eight. Female labor force. The guards army. Let's see what does it get? Plus two land and naval command points. Plus one here. Free Valentine tank allows a person of British tank and hurricane fighters. Ooh. Look at that. Okay. Sure. Thank you. Now, do I have anything I can get for three? I didn't think so, but that's okay. Close. Oh, I don't know what that dot is here. Seems we have an error here. All right, so we're going up here. We have another AT unit uh, when your core is defending Moscow. What's this say? Retaking Rostov will halt all German attempts to advance further south and the rest from 442 and free up troops. Well, hopefully we did that. And then this pin is defeating the German armored onslaught. And it's just starting to release another anti-tank unit when your corps is defending Moscow. All right. Well. Uh, well, let's just take a look at what we got as far as, um, this scenario. I realized this episode didn't realize it was going to be so short, 
Well, probably will just be a short one because I don't like starting a new one immediately after. So sorry about that. It's going to be a short one. But it is what it is, right? Okay. Let's see what the mission briefing awaits. Holy shit. I have a feeling that these green ones are them. And uh, that's it. Holy gee. Okay. Briefing awaits. Okay. Come in, comrade. The German offensive against Moscow is still fully underway. Right now, the enemy is mounting furious attacks against the outer defenses of the city. I do not have to stress the importance of Moscow being our capital, economic center, and political heart of Soviet Russia. You know? Wonderful. How big that map is. Interesting. I've got some rail guns. Onslaught. Okay. Both sides have taken serious losses from heavy combat during the past weeks, but German advances are still threatening Moscow. We need to. We, as we speak, yeah, if I could read, Panzer Group 4 spearheads are close to break through and encircle the north, encircle the city from north. We need to stop them with whatever it takes, okay, from the north. Further south, Panzer Group 2 Forces threaten uh, to pocket our troops defending Tula. Must be Tula. No doubt they intend to attack Moscow directly soon. In the center area of the front, German attacks are whatever, somewhat weaker as the enemy is hoping to encircle Moscow fully before storming the city itself. Right. Uh, that's gonna be a big map. Thirty turns. Your first priority is to defeat all major attacks against our capital. Fortunately, we are seeing signs that the enemy offense is losing steam. In order to protect Moscow from renewed attacks, the Kremlin plans to conduct a massive counterstrike to push the enemy away from our capital. All right. Wonderful. Do I get the troops to be able to do that is the question. Once you defeated all enemy attacks, Rotko will release further reinforcements to aid your forces in the offensive. Comrade, it is here where we have to stop the invaders to retain any hope for the future of our motherland. All right, well, 927, 76 points. 12 air, so that's good. So that means we're gonna have a lot, plus we got a couple of big ass bunkers in there, anti-aircraft. All right, well, we will wait and see what happens. So let's go back to, uh, let's go ahead and X to the menu. And we're going to call that an episode. So that gives us a little bit of a flavor. I'll cover that again real quick at the beginning. In my own words. Uh, you can read it uh, next time. Or if you're new, you can read it for the first time. And we'll be back next week with another episode. And it looks like the final battle of the Red Star campaign is the defense of Moscow. 30 turns. But we get just about a um, 1,000 points. And more importantly, 76 command points. So that means we can bring in some troops. We've got the north and the south, and we'll see what the center looks like for our deployments, which seems to be the big thing in this, is make sure that you deploy. So anyway, that is it for now. Thanks, like I say, thanks for joining me as always. I'm Captain Jake, wishing you fair winds and following seas.